Hey guys, welcome back to Next Gen Blogger. And in this video, I want to show you how you can create a stunning title introduction in VSCC Free Video Editor. So there are various ways in which you can introduce a title in your video. And today I will show you one of those ways. So without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now, as you can see, I've already imported two demo videos in the editor. And my second demo video is overlapping my first video by one second. Now I really did not need the second demo video, but I nevertheless added it because I wanted to extend the duration of my entire video. And so that's the reason we have a second demo video right here. And before we start, one thing which I would like you to keep in mind is that the duration of my first demo video is eight second. All right, eight. And so let's just get started. Double click on the first demo video. And now let me just quickly play this video for you. So first of all, what I would like to do is before I write my title, let me just add a fade in effect. So let me just go to video effects go to transparency, select fade in and then click on OK. Perfect. And let me just now quickly play the video for you. So right here is my video kind of fading in. Now what I would like to do is I would like to increase the duration of my fade in effect. So currently the duration of my fade in effect is one second. So let me just increase the duration of the fade in effect from one second to two second and then press enter. Perfect. And so now my fade in effect will take two second. So right here is my video fading in. Perfect. All right. Now we will write our title on top of the video. So I want my title to appear from one second in the timeline. So let me just place the cursor at one second. As you can see, my cursor is now at one second. And now let me just go to add object, go to text, click on text and then click on OK. Now mark your text object on top of the video like this and then click on set the same size as the parent has. Perfect. Now let's write some text inside the text box. So let me just write, let's say vlog hashtag one. And now let me just center align my text by clicking right here. Perfect. Now I would also like to decrease the duration of my text object. So currently the duration of my text object is seven seconds. And so I would like to decrease the duration of my text object from seven seconds to five seconds. So let me just write five inside the duration option and press enter. Perfect. All right. Now, so if I just quickly play the video for you from the start, here comes my video and then my text kind of directly jumps in. Now I would also like to add a feed in effect to my text. So let me just double click on the text object. And now let me just go to video effects, go to transparency, select fade in and then click on OK. Perfect. And so let me just quickly play the video for you once again. So now here comes my video fading in and then comes my text fading in. Perfect. Now my text kind of fades in and I would like to exit my text by fading it out. So let me just go to video effects, go to transparency, select fade out and then click on OK. Perfect. And so let me just quickly play the video for you once again. Here comes my video fading in, my text fading in and then my text will kind of fade out. Perfect. Now what we will do next is we will add a border around our text. All right. And so 
to do that first of all let me just place the cursor right now i am inside the text object all right so this is the main editing timeline so i double click on my first video then i have added fade in effect to my video then i added my text and inside my text i have added fade in and fade out and now i want to add a border around my text and so to add a border place the cursor at one second and now let me just go to add object select rectangle and then click on ok now mark your rectangle object around the text like this perfect and now look inside the rectangle object settings which is present inside the properties window and inside fill background currently solid is selected so first of all click on this drop down list and select transparent perfect and um, right here inside thickness as you can see currently the value is 1 so increase the value from 1 to 5 inside the thickness option and right above thickness you have the color option where currently the value is black and so if i just quickly show you as you can see right now i have a black border and so i want to change the color of the border from black to white so let me just change the color of the border from black to white and then click on ok perfect and so now if i just quickly play this entire video for you here comes my video fading in then my text fading in then my border my text fading out there goes my border all right now double click on the text object and now double click on the rectangle object which represents the border and what we are going to do is we are going to add a uh, some kind of transition so let me just go to video effects go to transitions select mosaic and then click on ok all right i want to spiral in my border or maybe spiral out so let me just place my mosaic transition right at the beginning like this and look inside the mosaic settings which is present inside the properties window currently spiral inside the type option spiral in is selected and inside the directly option false is selected so change the value inside the directly option from false to true and inside the gradi gradient length as you can see currently the value is 50 so once again change the value inside the gradient length option from 50 to 0 perfect and um, let me just change the or maybe not let me just see how my border is kind of looking so here comes my border let me just play this video for you once again all right so inside the cell size as you can see currently in pixels is selected so click on this drop down list and select in percent and now if i just quickly play the video for you perfect and so let me just quickly play this entire thing for you from the start so here comes my video fading in then comes my text fading in then comes my border around the text here is my uh, text fading out and then my border goes as well so i would like to add a fade out to my border as well so double click on the text object and then double click on the rectangle object and now right here i will add a fade out so go to video effects go to transparency select fade out and then click on ok perfect and so let me just quickly play this entire thing for you once again here comes my video here comes my text border around the text then both my text and border kind of fade out perfect and one final thing which i would like to do so this was the title introduction guys all right and so now what i would like to do is before i wrap up this video i would like to add a transition between these two videos 
and so to do that double click on the first demo video and then go to video effects go to video effects go to transitions select select let's say which transition should i use select wipe and then click on ok and now look inside the wipe settings which is present inside the properties window and inside the type option as you can see currently door is selected so click on this drop down list and select random strips and uh, inside the random strips wipe settings inside the gradient length as you can see currently the value is 50 so change the value inside the gradient length option from 50 to 0 perfect and so now if i just play this entire video for you from the start so here comes my video fading in then my text fading in border around the text then both my text and border fade out perfect so that's it guys this is how you can actually create a stunning title introduction in vscc free video editor do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see in the next video till then thanks for watching